incoming is level 82. There it is. So I tested out Zora with my new setup and the ornate pool and everything, and looks like I'm not going to need prayer potions. I can just, after each kill, go to my pool and run back. Medium casket from Fish and Care One. There we have it. Just arriving at 88 fishing, and I do believe that between the shark and the carambuan that I have, I should have 92 cooking in the bag as well. I missed it, but I did just get 92 cooking. I, my predictions were correct. All right, so we ended up with 2.1 and 1.2. Got a little mirror image, little mirror image going there. Look at that, 36, 36. I think this is actually the first time I've gotten a kill without using any supplies. I didn't touch anything. I mean, I drank a range potion before I came in, but I didn't touch nothing. I've been neglecting to do Shazy in favor for ever now, so I'm going to hopefully get a defense level. I'm less than 50k away while crushing this out. I will be switching over to organized crime once I get to it. Doing my second ever gang fight here. I just, on the world below this, I just did one and it gave me 20% killing all of them. That's crazy, man. So I I guess I'll only have to kill three gangs if it keeps giving me 20% to be at 100. I had to wait, you know, <laughs> like 20 minutes for it to uh, come up, but that's awesome. This is, this is going to turn into a lot of experience, I think, too. I mean, I kind of want to, I'm kind of, I'm going to keep going for a little bit and see if I get a, if I can get some good XP added up here. Very nice. Only Lovakench left, but really I just want to be able to kill shamans when I choose to. Can I hold it? Yeah, boy. Hey, yo. 95 defense and nope, <laughs> just 95 defense. I'm rocking, rocking it, dude. Love it. Oh yeah. How beautiful is it? Wow. Stunning. Stunning and brave. Well, I just unlocked Lizardmen from Duradel and did a little Steel Dragon task, so... Oh, Black Dragons, alright. Figure one of these days I really should get Ranger Boots, so I'm doing a Dagonoth task just on the low-level mobs. And here's my first medium clue. Obligatory recording of opening the casket. Okie do. Alright, here we are. <laughs> Figured now would be a good time to try Wilderness Slayer for the first time. <laughs> so, I'm, I already got one emblem. I ain't taking no chances. Get myself an emblem, I bring it to the bank. Get an emblem, bring it to the bank. This is my first ever Wilderness Slayer task. Apparently you have to do five before you start getting points for it. So I kind of am messing my plan up of getting a lot of points from doing this, but I figure I'll stick with it for a bit. This is my fourth emblem this task. I've gotten four emblems so far on this greater demon task. I think I only had like 150 to kill. I know I'm getting mad lucky. There's something there is something going on here because this is not I feel like this is not normal. I've completed two wilderness tasks. I have no recollection of doing one before. No recollection. I think this will go pretty smoothly. I've never used a blowpipe on a slayer task like this though. Should be legit. I'm only in level seven wilderness, man. I probably could have brought more items. I think I'll be getting points from this one. Look at that, 25 points with a, to with a measly total of 38. Well, I wanted to get that out of the way. Yo, for real, it was crazy. I got four, I got f those four totems, emblems. I got those four emblems on my first task, man. And I, I think I saw one, no, no, I saw two since then, I think. I couldn't exactly switch on the recording, but, uh, I mean, he wasn't exactly a high level either, but, Oh, this guy came in to where I was at Greater Demons to kill me, 
and uh, like he was getting me pretty low and stuff. And I decided, you know what the hell, I'm just going to try to fight him. He had uh, ranged mage and melee, you know? And uh, I just, he like ran off eventually from me fighting him. Uh, and I just stayed at demons for a second. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to go chase him. So I did. And I caught him at the obelisk and, uh, we fought, I used my whole inventory of not, I say whole inventory. He's like 12 sharks fighting him there and, uh, just doing prey switches and stuff on him. And, uh, so, you know, switched to accurate, killed his ass. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> oh yeah. Sorry. I couldn't get the recording of it, but. <laughs> get out of here get out of here i'm having a great time doing wilderness slayer it's it's been a lot of fun to be honest with you i really haven't done too much yet but i'm like i'm like in uh having to actually explore the wilderness and sort of learning where everything is here i spend so little time here it's really kind of cool I'm kind of enjoying it a lot yeah, I get emblems from level 14 scorpions. No big deal. Three emblems from those mammoths. Thank you very much. Medium casket coming in. All right. I have just about half the points I need for the room pouch, and I got a fair amount of points now. I'm going to go back and see if I can get that lizard man task. I just I just really want to kill him, man. I want to kill him. But I need to kill him in, in solid, solitude. In solitary. Solitude. Medium casket. Oh. Um, what did I walk in on? This is too many in one spot, man. I don't have any audio for this PvP fight coming up, but as soon as I teleported to Deep Wild for you know, my Revenant task, as soon as I teleported there, I got frozen, and I turned the recording on about halfway in. I mean, I wasn't even thinking straight. I mean, I, I didn't range pot till late. I didn't drink a defense thing, and yeah, but I'm happy with the, I'm happy with the end result there. <laughs> I literally just teleported here and he started attacking me. That is so fucking funny, man. I don't have, I mean, he, I used all my food on him and stuff, but I forgot to range pot like way early and oh my God, what an idiot. <laughs> I love, I love when you get a kill in there, man. I got back to Edgeville pretty quick and I've been waiting for around 10 minutes to see if I can find this guy and you know, the, the guy I just killed. I haven't seen him. I hope that that means that he just logged out and he's doing something better with his life. Or, uh, you know, just in shame. I hope he feels a lot of shame right now. I hope he feels ashamed of himself. <laughs> <laughs> now, it's all in good fun, but he should feel bad. Okay, so I've been to the cave a couple times now, and it's just a free-for-all. Everywhere I go, there's just people sculling up left and right, so I'm just going to skip this test. Oh, and glad I did skip it. I get an emblem and an insult demon head on my first kill of this task. For real, I've killed like two more, and I've got another one already. Um, I'm going to have this room pouch in no time. Okay, this is my fifth emblem this task. I brought some back because um, I wanted to look at something in my bank real quick, but yeah, fifth emblem, one more, and if I get one more emblem, I got the room pouch, baby. Yeah, boy. All right, this is my this is my last mysterious emblem. I can get the room pouch now. That's what I'm talking about.
after I finish this task. I'm not sure if I'll continue to do Wildy Slayer. Not quite sure what I'm going to do. So first order of business is get the pouch. And now I'm going to fill it up with Venge runes and try that out. I've never done Vengeance at Zora. And I think I can just turn it on whenever I see a ranged attack during the mage phase. So I'm going to give that a shot. Should be cool. Well, I'm a noob. I don't have level 94 magic. I'm only 93. But we're still going in. Really? One forty five, a new personal best for my scrubness. My scrubby dub scrubness. With double snakeskin drop, man, cool. Alrighty, this will be kill number four hundred at Zora. How is it? How are we doing today? Mm, nothing too special. And that is a shiny number. Nice. Medium clue casket. Another medium clue casket. Oh, 14k. That's kind of nice, I guess. Another medium casket. Oh, a Sarah page. This is just a bunch of range stuff. All right. Hey guys, I'll be wrapping the episode up here. I'm going to see if I can upload a little more frequently if I make my videos just a little bit shorter. I seem to be getting plenty of footage. If there's anything that you want to see a lot more of or any anything you really don't want to see, or if, maybe if you just don't like my voice, uh, you know, just let me know. Let me know what's going on. Let me know what's going on in, in your little head brains. Let me know what's rumbling in your belly gut and what you're thinking about in your head brain. I'll be here. I'll be here. I'll be there. And I'll be square. I'll see you guys soon. Have fun scaping.